What's the first thing someone thinks about when someone says feral? Something wild, right? A cat usually comes to mind that looks mangy and sickly, maybe having cuts and injuries from its multiple territory fights. A blind eye, missing limb. Sometimes that's all very true. Sometimes it's not. The world can be unpredictable. The world can be unforgiving and harsh. It takes great luck and a lot of skill to survive. We'll be following the lives of these ferals and how they survive in the ever-changing environment around them. This is Feral. Hello everyone, this is Unalia, and I am back here again on the same day, on a Wednesday, when we had these little kits uh, get treated. So, not quite the next day. It's about to be, it's going to be, so on Thursday they will be somewhat, um, fixed, maybe. So we are still, or they are still dealing with the rogues that happened upon them and made kittens that no one wanted. <laughs> No one should have had. Um, those rogues really made life hard, but we now have this very cute and adorable bundles of fur that are the new future leaders of the pride, the group, the family, whatever it is. I am... Um, proud to have them if they survive this whole green cough event. <laughs> ah, and then this one. Isn't this one pretty? Oh, the leg. Isn't this one really pretty? She is so, so cute. Like a little angel. So yeah, we've got um... A lot of grandmothers, grandfathers, um, especially in Aisling's line, I think she's the only one that has a grandfather and a grandmother, which is, uh, Thessalus and, or, and Jazz, or Thessalus and Seors, uh, and currently Seors is missing. Who are you? Oh, Dronus. Hi, Dronus. Aren't you cute? You are so pretty. You are like your father and your grandmother. Or was it your grandfather? I, either way. Those stripes, man. Those stripes. Um, and then Fair was like his mother and his grandfather. Or his grandmother. Something like that. Anyways, there's a really good mix between all of these kits, and we've only lost one, which is really, really sad. Kellar did not make it. He had too severe of a green cough, and it just got him. Being a newborn and all, it just... It'll, it'll hit him hard. But uh, currently, um, there's a lot of these plants that are not in season but I kind of wish for them to be so um, what we're going to do what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a thing Make sure I'm not cutting off any cats while I'm moving the bushes. Eesh. What I'm going to do is I am going to put a random bush right there. That's that's a good spot for it, right there. Mm -hmm. And then we are going to build uh, a box. We're going to build a box. Okay, so there are some changes here. 
Um, I want to see if it's actually going to work or not, but it probably won't. I know these won't be able to go over there now. Which really sucks, honestly. So we're going to take this bowl of food and put it in here. Um. Uh oh. I just. Eh, fuck, it's fine. <laughs> I just sold a tree. That's okay. So then we're gonna put this bowl of food over here. There. Alright, so, let's see. Iceling is hungry. And, uh, she's needing to go to the bathroom. Nea's is gonna play and go to the bathroom at some point. Has everyone been fed? It would seem like all the little kits are indeed fed. Oh, that's Seo. Okay, yeah. Alright, so everyone's been fed. Good deal. Ah, so I'm going to have all the kits sleep today. And I'm also going to have... Oh, she's... Doing okay. Oh, she's still crying. Oh, Suna. Guess what? My day would liberally went when liberally Lee Liberty Lee went very well. Congrats. Okay, so apparently my <laughs> my ocean spirit is dating Liberty Lee. Meanwhile, my forest spirit has been going out with oh where is he at? Advath. I think we're gonna invite Advath over. Uh, it, well, it's 7 p.m., so. Okay. We'll have him hang out. Oh! Oh! I totally forgot they're growing up today! Oh my god. Sue and Walla's growing up today. And so is her brother Nea's. Oh my gosh. If they become adult, that means... Sue and Walla! Look at you! Okay, so since Sue and Walla aged up, the 39 that was making her sick was... She's fine! She... And Nayaz grew up too? They're both fine. They're just fine. Oh my gosh. They grew up and became adults and this saved them. This really did say um save them. Okay, so uh Nayas <laughs> You can be out here. Teleport here. And then Sue and Walla. You can come out here too. 
And so now these two can go hunting. And I think the Solace is going to come and talk to... Where did Nez go? <laughs> Nez is already over here. Jesus. Okay. Uh, oh, he's going to go use the litter box. Okay. So I think the Solace is going to come and talk to his daughter. I talk to Suanwala. Well, or she's just needing to go to the bathroom too. That's fine. Oh, look at him. Let's have her go use the litter box. I think her dad is like really congratulating her on getting out of, you know, the sickness and stuff. Uh, wait a minute, what? Oh wait, I never noticed him to come over. Was he? Was he coming over? I don't remember seeing him come by. is coming over. Alright, so what is fair? Oh, the pebbles and the... Okay, well, let's get those two hunting. Okay, so Sue and Walla and her brother are sitting out on a hunting patrol. And Sue and Walla is going over there and Nez is going over here. So, Sue and Walla had no luck, but Nez came through. He got two pieces of prey and three experience. So, now their father is going to tell them, go back out hunting because this isn't good enough. So, they're going to go back out hunting again. Okay, so, Ne uh, Sue and Walla went back out hunting and she got... Uh, one experience and one piece of prey which was her father just rolled her eyes and said good enough whatever so I think he's gonna make them go in there and feed the cats fill the bowl that's gonna take up most of the food and then he's gonna fill that bowl too Oh, we have the guy. The guy is here. And Furball is here. Sydney is here. 
Don't you pay? Oh, card duel. <laughs> so let me look at this guy. Advath Sravastava. So while she's getting used to this guy and no, no M. Um. Just see how well they uh they go. Oh, they just, he just wants to be friends with her. Dang. That just happened. That is sad. Seos is back? What? Oh my god, Seo! Seo came back! Oh my god. Say it was back. And honestly, I'm glad that she is back. Oh, who's this? Mojo? Who the heck is Mojo? Well, uh-oh. This is gonna be bad, because now... The Solace... He's pouncing someone? What? Hold, hold on. Hold on. The Solace, hold on. Okay, so I just rolled for the Solace on fighting and how many tries he has. He has eight. So this makes one. <laughs> so now he has seven more. He is in rare form today. Jesus, who is he fighting? My jaw's on the floor. The solace. Okay, so the solace is really badly beat up. Uh, he's got a broken right hip. He's got he's been strangled in his throat. He's got a busted nose. He's got a minor bite on his left cheek. Minor scratches on his right right hip, um, but the winner has minor scratches on the rump. That's all, uh, and I do believe this is it for the Solace. He lost his leadership status, and Huey is can't believe this. So he, t uh, and he's now up to four experience of fighting. Oh no, I wonder what the clan is going to do now. Oh no, the kits. Oh no. Oh Jesus, I gotta do some, oh my God. There's so much to do. Christ, man! <gasps> oh, man. Oh, okay. So, this just went bad from bad to really, really bad to really worse. Um, this cat, Huey, could come in and kill the kits. Um, because they're not his. So, um, yeah, this is pretty bad.
Uh, Thessalus is going to have to be forced out by Huey. And he's going to, uh... Oh, God. Oh, man. Okay. Hegdard is on the prowl. And he is after Kits. No one knows about how these cat. Uh, no one knows about um, the Solace losing yet. And he has his eye on Fizz. Well, I mean, he does have his eye on the kits, so we're going to roll see if this and Auth are in danger. Okay, well. Oh, the fry pan into the fire. <laughs> Alright, this, he's injured, he rolled a 44, so... Hegdar went after him. Uh, Oth, Oth is injured. Uh, he rolled a 45. Um, so now Seo and Suanwala are like, what's going on? Who is this cat? And I think Seo is going to be going after Hegdar. Ounce. And who was it? Suanwala is going to take That didn't really work out at all. What the heck? Okay, so Hegdar is like, ah, okay, whatever, you know. Um, you can't you can't do anything about me. Tawana, uh, Seo. More choices. So I guess she likes Hegdard or something. I don't know. But now that she knows that, you know, he's got the blood of Thessalus on him, and she can smell like blood over here and stuff, she knows that things kind of got really bad. So I think she's going to be calling out. Uh, she's gonna be calling out to yound her. And so now Ioban is going to hear this. And Ioban sees the mail. And is very. kind of protective of him. Like, not protective, but she's, she's like regarding him. So I think she's going to go... Be mean to him. She's she's taking care of Oth. So now she's chasing him away from the kits. She's angry. So I think she's going to Oh, attack him. She's going to attack Headguard. 
Oh, now he's scared. He's like, oh god, I f***ed up. Where's I been? No, come over here. I mean. Pounce. If anything, Ioban is going to try and protect uh, her family. So now he's chasing her back. Oh, he's he's really having it with her. She's going to pounce him now. Oh! And she's also joined by Suenwala. Get him, Suenwala! Oh no, these two are playing. So, since I, uh, not Ayoben, but Suenwala is the sister of Ayoben. Wait. What? <laughs> Hold on. Who is Ayoben? Ayoben. Yeah, she's the sister of, of them. So anyways, I think they're going to... They've told him off, Hegdard. And they're not going to let him anywhere near the kits. Oh, and here's Seo! Seo's back! Oh my god. Seo's coming over here to pounce her daughter. What? <laughs> Why are you pouncing your daughter? <laughs> Isn't that just creepy? Just having a cat creep in and... <laughs> Is she gonna fight her? I hope not. Oh, okay, they're just playing. Good. Okay, so Seo's here. She's playing with her daughter. Uh, actions. More choices. So I think she's going to pet talk to Hegdard. And she is the lead female. No. I talked to Hegdard. So she's kind of keeping it a little bit of civil here. Oh. Okay. That. Wasn't good. So now she's hostile and chasing him. Or she was being hostile, chased by him. So he's he's a very strong Tom. Oh my god. And he is making it known that this place is his now. 
and she has no control. So now he's gonna go take the food. So there's a lot of cats here that are not happy with kits, or not happy with uh, Hegdard here. And I do believe uh, this He's going to be brought back into Iceling's area. Got injured. And then the other little kit, Auth, is also going to be brought in because they got injured as well. And so they're just going to rest for a little bit. So now we got to deal with all of the sick kits again. Oh boy, we need to come down here. No catnip. Up over here. No. No. Oh dear. <laughs> oh my gosh, nuzzle nip. The nuzzle nip just came in. The catnip just came in. Oh my god. That was amazing. All of these plants just came in. We got n 13 nuzzle nip. Um, let's see here. Madnip, 22. We got 6 Lavender, 24 time. 15 Catnip! <gasps> oh my gosh. We can save the clan. We can save the kits. Everything's gonna be good. Oh my god. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Oh my god, this is so good. So good. Okay, so the next one we need was... Uh, Nez. Where's Nez? Where's Nez? Oh, that's right, Nez is, is, is well. So Suanwala and Nez are adults, so they're fine. Jesus. All right, so now we get we need to do Fistil. Uh, where is Fistil? Fistil, Fistil, Fistil. Here we go, Fistil. All right. Uh, I rolled a six, and that's seventy percent of potency, and then rolled a forty-nine. Uh, so Fistil is still very sick. Oh. So now we have a 10% a chance of going up. Alright, well... Fistil died. This gorgeous tabby passed away. I'm so sorry, Fistil. Yep. There's Fistil. Fistil didn't get enough uh, in time and died. Oh my god. Okay, so now I need to find Brilla. Where's Brilla? Brilla. So, Brilla, she is still bad as well. Um, we rolled a 5, which is also 70%, and 60, and it should have been more than 70, and she's dead. Brilla, gone as well. Crystal, Brilla, both. I have been lost both her daughters 
That is so sad. Okay, so Dronus. The beautiful black cat Dronus. Black and, and white cat. So uh, we rolled a 10, which is 95%. And then we rolled a 52. So the herbs didn't work either. And he is now... He has a 10% chance of it going, uh, getting worse, and it did. So he's now at 42, which is sick. Because the first herb we, we got him with, it helped him lower it. Lower the illness. So. Jesus Christ, this is difficult, man. We got a sick kit. Lost two kits. We lost actually three kits now. Kalalan, Brilla, and Fistil. Alright, so now for Rular. Rular is pretty bad off. He's at 64 right now. Oh, man. Alright, so Rular, he had a number 3, rolled a number 3, which is the 50% chance, and then we rolled a 37, so the herbs didn't work either. And it now went up to 10% of the green cough getting worse, so now he's at 74. He still has severe green cough. And if he goes up anymore, he's going to die. So, he, he's very close to getting gone. Uh, Fair, where's Fair? Fair, they're in the toilet. In the nasty toilet. So, Fair, you're at 65. Oh my god. Fair gets to live, you guys. Fair is all better. Oh, oh, my favorite little kitty kit. Oh my goodness, Fair. So Fair, uh, is that was at sixty five, and that's some some really rough in the middle of the rough green cough. Um, and then we rolled a three for fifty percent of potency, and then we rolled a sixty three. So Fair uh, got 50% uh, taken away on the 65, and so now it's at 15. And so she's she's healed! He? She? What are you, Fair? You're, you're a guy, aren't you? Male. Tim? Tom? Alright, Fair, you get to, you get to leave the, the den. Alright, so Fair is... Good. Alright, so now we need off. Where is off? Off is here. Oh my gosh. Hello, off. Beautiful white cute cat. Alright, so. Oh, wait. Off? No, not off. Off got beat up. That's right. Um, I need Nessen. Nessen, Nessen. Here's Nessen. Off is fine, but Off is also beat up, so Off has to stay. Um, Nessen, you're at 41, which is a really low of uh, sickness. Okay, so Nessen, she was at 41, now she's at 51. She has green cough. Uh, we rolled an 8 for 90%, and then we rolled a 35, so her sickness got worse, and the herbs didn't work. Oh, goodness me. Crap. We've lost 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 of these herbs. Of catnip or something, what was it? Lavender, oh no. Alright, so we now have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We have 9 cat, uh, catnip left. Alright, so uh, Aisling is going to try again. The herb worked. 
We rolled a 2 for 10% and then rolled a 49. So we got it. We good. Um, the herb did wonders. So now Jonas is at 32. He is still sick, but less sick than he was. So Ruler was at 74. He is now at 64. He st still has green cough, but less, you know, it, it's being treated. Uh, he rolled a 2 for 10% and then uh, a 68. So it was a fully effective... Awesome. So Nessun is still sick. Uh, the herb rolled 8, 90%, and we rolled 43, so that didn't really work out too well. We lost it. Um, but Nessun is still okay. She still has green cough. Nothing changed. She's still at 51. So... So now I need to get rid of some more of nizzle nip. Catnip. This is rough. This is really rough. Alright, so we got some kits outside. Got Ioban over here. Cytrail's here. Sayoris is here. Where is the new Tom? The new leader of... Oh, hang on. Is... the trash can... Can you not reach the trash can? I guess not. Oh, she's hungry. And she's got zero energy. So, let's get her some stuff, shall we? Um, let's get her to come over to this madnip. Absorb solar energy. And then she can also come over here to these daisies, absorb solar energy. And I think she would come over here to the daisy bush again, absorb the solar energy. Oh, Cleo delivered... Logie delivered two male babies, one female. Cleo delivered two male babies, two female babies, okay. Loki and Cleo. Hmm. You popping them out. Alright, where is that other uh, bush? Absorb solar energy. Harvest all those catnip. Wild pear tree. Okay, so she's not doing too bad. We're keeping her alive. And I'm kind of curious of how much catnip we're going to get from this bush over here. Poor tree. of us three get three yeah three oh. she's just awesome. passing through the grasses okay oh it's time to go hunting also. So let's go have them let's go have them let's have them go all go hunting. Uh Hegdard is kinda checking the females out. 
And since he's not related to any of them, we'll have to see which ones like him and which ones don't. So, I know straight up Seo is not going to like him. Uh, Suen, well, Cytrel, she is kind of curious, I wonder. Um, Iobin, not really interested, but she did just lose her kids. So, Iobin might be a possibility. Um, Aisling. She's still got her kits, but he is after them, so she is not too happy. Um, Suenwella, she has no kits, so she's a possibility as well. Neyes, uh, Neyes is a male. We no. <laughs> So, possibilities are Suenwella, uh, Aisling? Was it Aisling or no? No, not Aisling. Ioben. Ah ha! Cytrel. Oh, wait, no. Cytrel still has kits, I think. Oh, well, she. She might be losing her kids, so possibly. Um, and then of course, Seo. Seo hasn't lost her three new kids yet, so. Um, possible. All right. I'll give I'll be back uh in a moment. I got to go do some stuff and then I will bring them all hunting.